In this video we'll briefly discuss almost all you need to know about ranitidine. What it's used for, how it works, the dose and side effects, contraindications and some important advice to the patients receiving it. Ranitidine belongs to a category of drugs called H2 blockers. It inhibits histamine action on H2 receptors, which are found on the gastric parietal cells. And this action reduces the secretion of gastric acid. So it is used in the prevention and treatment of duodenal and gastric ulcers, heartburn, acid indigestion and gastroesophageal reflux disease, or known as GERD. It is also used for stress-induced ulcers, and ulcers induced by the use of non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. And also used in combination with amoxicillin and clarithromycin, in the treatment of Helicobacter pylori. Ranitidine is known commercially as Zantac. And there are many other trade names, so use the drug index of your country to know all of them. It is available as tablets and capsules in concentrations of 75. 150 and 300 milligrams, and as syrup, 15 milligrams per milliliter, and injection, 25 milligrams per milliliter, and also available as effervescent. The usual dose of ranitidine is once or twice daily, at least either 30 minutes or one hour before meals, or once a day at bedtime. It can also be used as an intravenous or intramuscular injection. Common side effects of ranitidine are, headache, nausea and vomiting, diarrhea or constipation. It is contraindicated in hepatic and renal dysfunction. So the dose must be monitored in case of kidney or liver diseases. So, some advice to patients receiving ranitidine. Avoid alcohol and smoking, as this may worsen the case. Don't take antacids at the same time as drug separate administration by at least one hour. If you notice these symptoms report them to your physician. Abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, change in color or consistency of stools, black stools or coffee ground emesis. Generally avoid taking ranitidine more than two weeks, unless symptoms persist, then ask your health care provider. That's all for this video. Subscribe to get more drug information.